as a web developer i go through tons of photos and i have this habit of sampling the colors in them to use them in my projects to do that generally i open the photo in an editor grab the color picker sample the color and copy it to a text file or into my css which is straightforward but time taking to minimize the time spending on that i made a python script so when i run it and click anywhere on the screen it will get me the rgb and x value at the cursor position the dependencies for this project are pillow it's a popular image processing library we'll be using the image grab module we'll talk more about that later and then we'll be using py input which will be used to handle our keyboard and mouse events let's install them first with pip install pillow space py input let's take a look at the documentation both the mouse and the keyboard have this listener class with callbacks which we'll use on click for mouse and on release for keyboard so first let's import keyboard and mouse from py input along with the image grab module from pillow let's wrap the main part in if name equal equals main now let's declare the keyboard listener as keyboard listener block with on release callback as on rel which we'll define shortly and within this let's also write the mouse listener as mouse listener with on click callback as on click if we look at the documentation both the listeners are actually their own separate threads so to use both of them simultaneously we have to join them let's define the on rel callback which takes a key parameter since i want to quit the script if i hit escape i can check if the key is the escape key then i'll just written false to stop the thread since i also want to stop the mouse events i can just stop it here itself with the stop method moving on to the on click it takes in four parameters x y the button itself and a boolean to check if the button was pressed so if the button is pressed and it's a left click we can now just print the coordinates here let's try running it and there it is the coordinates of the screen one thing in mind is the 00 is at the top left corner and hitting escape should stop the script perfect now let's move to the main part getting the colors if we look at the pillow documentation image grab module does what it says it takes screenshot of the screen and returns as a pillow image we can include a bounding box to avoid full size screenshots in memory as well back to the code let's define a get color function which will take in the coordinates of the cursor let's define the bounding box starting at x and y and add a pixel to the right and bottom for a 2 by 2 pixel screenshot now let's call the graph function with the bounding box which returns a pillow image then we can use get pixel which will get us the rgb values now since the screenshot is only 2 by 2 pixel we'll send in 0 0 as the coordinates which holds the original x and y of this screen now let's use f strings to print the value to convert rgb into x we can use get x which takes in the rgb tuple and returns as this formatted string person 0 to x here x denotes it should be in hexadecimal so the same thing three times for rgb which we can print out in the f string final thing to do is remove this and call the get color function instead let me pull up an image to the side and see it in action that is indeed very useful i'll drop the links to the very well written docs in the description below along with the github repo for this project